Protesters clashed with police in Moscow as they demonstrated against constitutional reforms that could see President Vladimir Putin in power until 2036. Police detained more than 100 people, according to human rights monitor OVD Info, including journalists and a high-profile Moscow deputy who headed the campaign against Putin's controversial changes. Earlier in the day, she was already well aware of the risk she was taking. The 500-strong crowd called for Putin to resign and signed a petition against the reform. They believe the overwhelming vote in favour of the constitutional overhaul was rigged. And a rally was held in St. Petersburg, where the queue to sign the petition there was reportedly a kilometre long. Many here are worried that Russian democracy is in danger. In the wake of the vote, lawmakers have already moved to outlaw gay marriage in a further erosion of citizens' rights. In 2018, a report from the think tank Freedom House gave Russia 15 out of 60 for civil liberties and ranked the country as not free. Okay, and that's where we're going to have